By Allah, Allah loves you all. And by Allah, Allah wants care for you. And by Allah, Allah wants to see you in Jannah. The question is, do you want to see Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in Jannah? Indeed, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said in the authentic hadith, Man ahabba liqa Allah, ahabba Allahu liqa'ah, wa man kariha liqa Allah, kariha Allahu liqa'ah. Whoever loves to meet Allah, Allah loves to meet him. And whoever hates to meet Allah, Allah hates to meet him. Ask yourself, are you from those people? My brothers and my sisters in Islam, my brothers and my sisters in Islam, one day the Prophet wasallam stood up in the depths of the night. It is authentically reported in Al-Bukhari that he raised his hands up to the heavens and he said, Oh Allah, my Ummah, my Ummah. Ya Allah, my Ummah, my Ummah. Ya Allah, my Ummah, my Ummah. He couldn't say more than that. He couldn't finish his sentences because he was so emotional until the night passed and the last third of the night came until Fajr time came. And at that point, Jibreel alayhi salatu wasalam came down and said, Ya Muhammad, Ya Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam, Allah has sent me and said, Ya Muhammad, your Lord will not disappoint you regarding your ummah. Your Lord will not disappoint you regarding your ummah. The question is, brothers and sisters of Islam, are we going to disappoint our Prophet Sallallahu Are we going to disappoint our Prophet Sallallahu Allah has promised our Prophet, He will not disappoint him regarding our Ummah. The question is us, are we going to otherwise not fulfill the promise of Allah and be a disappointment for our Prophet Sallallahu Be you of those people who fulfill his vision. Be you of those people who fulfill your love for Allah but pursuing the vision of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam on this earth.